Hello everybody. Today, again, we'll be talking about sports. Texas Tech sports. This time, the Texas Tech football team. Yeah. They're led by this man, Joey McGuire. He's in his third season with Texas Tech. Yeah. He's had a winning season the past two seasons and, and capped off those both seasons with a bowl victory. And yeah. And this is their quarterback, Baron Morton, junior quarterback from Eastland, Texas. He's a gr great player, yeah. Last year he dealt with a shoulder injury that, so, but he's coming back stronger this year, and yeah. He's gonna be one of the great tech quarterbacks that ever come out of Texas Tech, and yeah. And this is Taj Brooks, who was third in the nation in le uh, rushing last year, yeah. He's only 1,000-something yards away from the all-time rushing record at Texas Tech. Yeah. And, yeah. They opened their season at home against Abilene Christian on August 31st. Then the next uh, week, they traveled to Washington State to play Washington State. The next week, they will be hosting North Texas they start conference play against Arizona State on September 21st. September 28th, they'll be hosting Cincinnati. September 5th, October 5th, they will travel to Arizona to play Arizona. October 19th, they have a uh, bye week in this time frame. During two weeks later, they'll be playing Baylor at home. A week later, they'll be playing TCU at TCU. Yeah. Then the next week, they'll travel to Iowa State to play Iowa. Then, on November 9th, they'll be playing Colorado against Shador, Travis, and Deion Sanders from Colorado. Then they'll travel to play Oklahoma State two weeks later. The week before Thanksgiving, yeah. Then they, two days after Thanksgiving, they'll be having their last senior day against West Virginia, yeah. Baron Martin last year had 1,754 yard, passing yards and 15 passing touchdowns. Taj Brooks had 1,541 uh, yards. Yeah. He was third in the nation in rushing. Yeah. And he had 10 rushing touchdowns. And he's going to uh, gonna be the all-time leading rusher in Texas Tech football history after this season. And yeah. The main receivers coming back are Koy Aiken, Jordan Brown, Dre McRae, Mason Tharp, Brady Boyd, and yeah. They add their uh, five-star receiver, Micah Hudson, from and Caleb Douglas and L.J. Johnson, Jr., Chad Den Myers from Hamlet, Holly, yeah. They had also Jalen Conyers from Groover. Yeah. On defense, they'll be anchored by Bryce Ramirez, Ben Roberts, CJ Baxterfield, and other names that I don't know right now. And also AJ McCarty from Brownwood, Braylon Lux, Maureen Horan, Joseph Plunk. Sammy Morris, Anthony White from Abernathy, Marcus Ramon Edwards, and uh, part of the offensive line, they are led by Caleb Rogers, this man right here, who's a great player all around, great human being all around too. Yeah. He likes to lift lots, lots of weights in the uh, and this is Taj Brooks, 
who's about to be the all-time leading rusher in Texas Tech football history. Yeah. He's a great dude and great human being all around, and yeah. He, he will truck you. Yeah, I like to play him in college football 25, and yeah. And him and Barron, and yeah. But anyhow, Texas Tech will have a great season this year. They'll probably win the Big 12, and yeah. But yeah, thank y'all for listening to this latest segment video, and yeah.